Say hi, Nomad. Say hi, Levels, boy. Yeah. Okay, hang on. There you go, put on these headphones. Ah, oh, okay. Ooh. Yes, we have a visitor. This is my son. Yeah, yeah. Are you my lab house boy? See, my name is Atreus Gabriel. Yeah. Say hi, Nomad. Say hi, lab house boy. <laughs> you are the cutest thing in existence, kid. <laughs> Headphones on, never ass boy. <laughs> oh God, kid, I, I can't. <laughs> you my never ass boy. <laughs> oh God. Absolutely, man. Hey, he got mine too. It was an equal. It was a fifty-fifty thing. <laughs> I think they were a never ass boy. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, is that funny? Is that funny, Levels boy? <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> is that my Levels boy? Yeah. Yeah, you're the cutest in existence. You're the cutest in existence. <laughs> Nomad. Yeah. Yeah, we're hanging out with Nomad. Daddy, Daddy's buddies. Actually, I think this side's better. Oh, God. Daddy's wrist is all effed up. Kind of want to give you a booster seat. Yeah. That's the loud ass boy. I'm not that bad boy. Okay. So down here. There we go. That might help a little bit. Mm -hmm. Load the game, that ass boy. Amazing us and favored us boy. Yeah. Are you snuggling with daddy's never ass boy? Are you snuggling? Huh? Get it. <gasps> look. Look, never ass boy. Look. Um, <laughs> I actually didn't because, uh, I don't know what the hell happened. When I clicked on the save file, he ended up across the map. So when I loaded this time around, he was like somewhere else. He wasn't even where the save file was. So I said, you know what? F it. I'm just going to go do other things. So. 
Maybe I should go back and hate my life again. It's a sign, yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, I the save file was here, and he was, like, right next to here, and then when I loaded it again, he was, like, over here. Like, he was over here in the, like, gray. And he was on a horse. So, dude, like, hog riders everywhere, apparently. He ran away. Yeah. Because he knew we were going to kill him. Because he knew I was too damn stubborn to let him leave. So he had to, like, go across the map where I wouldn't follow. It worked. Are you doing big yawns? Are you doing big yawns, that boy? <laughs> Why are you being cute, that boy? Are you being cute? Yeah, you're being cute. That's what it's like being a rare gentleman. Okay, let's go this way. We're gonna go to a dip a waypoint, okay? Okay, dev house boy. Okay. Yes. Yeah, you like daddy's headphones, don't you? They're cool, aren't they? That was, boy, don't take them off daddy's head. Don't take them off daddy's head. He's like, but I want to. But I want to, dad. <laughs> what are you doing, kid? Huh? I scared him off with my tenaciousness, yeah. I hear that. Okay, ready? Jump off. Whee! And Daddy's gonna call the boat. Daddy's calling the boat. the boat. Alright. Bah. Bah. Oot. Oot. <laughs> okay, love ass boy. We're gonna go to the waypoint. Let the sail out! Looks like Ragnarok itself came for Grand Bridge. A great battle raids nearby. Old course. We'll see what else lies within the fork. Some sort of armed camp there. Ooh. I'm down to raid. Put the sail in. Take me in. What are you doing? Yes, no, but it won't let me raid. the raid button. I'm down to raid. What's up, dude? Thanks, man. <laughs> That's Uncle Sethi and Uncle Jesse. Hush now. <gasps> Who is that? Yeah. Who the heck is that? Who the heck is that, my guys, boy? You want to see Sethi? Often. Repeat the Raven this day. Do it. 
Dead Creighton. Yeah, yeah, I, I actually just got it. Yeah. I had to get it. Yeah, dude. Should have a look around. I heard that too. I heard I'm sure that makes you very excited. Is that your favorite video game character? Guys eat. We'll do lunch. It's it's getting there. It's 11:30. We can. I'm sure. Uh, I'm sure uh, Seth is gonna recommend some bundle boxes. Fun game. You've played the second one? Hey, there's, there's a there's a second. You're talking about the um, the RTS version? So like it's like StarCraft where you control armies and stuff? Or uh, oh, okay, got you, got you, got you. I thought it was called Reach. I mean, so I'm playing through the first one. What's cool is they just pushed them to PC. I used to have an Xbox, um, a 360, and um, I played the um, Halo Wars typically, but um, I, I, I played the first Halo, and I loved it. Absolutely loved the first yeah. Halo. Um, and um, we are going to beat that, because I've never beaten any of them, and I've... You never beat them? No, because I never, I never played them, but you like... To do that I'm down. I have them too. Yeah, like I have the whole collection. So like, cause I, I'm down. Yeah, but like, yeah, um, I'm playing. I think it might be cross-platform too. I think you don't have to necessarily be on PC, but you might. So that would definitely be something. Maybe Nomad would know. Nomad, do you know? Do you know if um, uh, it, it's cross-platform with Halo? I'll wait till he responds, but, like, um, yeah, dude, like, I've, I've enjoyed it so far, because I definitely wanted to play through that series, because that's by far Xbox best. Yeah. Oh, Nomad's gonna go. check. Yeah, because I think I tried it. I've tried a few, but, um, I've never beaten any of them. Never, like, played through all of them, so I'm actually really excited to do that. I've been doing that with my, uh, with my tech friend. I have all of them. Okay, so yeah, I so. Can, I know where all the skulls are. Oh, that's dope. So, yeah. yeah, yeah, dude. I think, I, my buddy Nomad was semi-pro in Halo Three, oh, really? and Reach, 
So, yeah, he was very good. That's cool. But Did it. Hey, you went to a what? Inheritor level. Inheritor level? Yeah. Hey, my uh, my brother, my brother-in-law wants to know if you got to an inheritor level, no man. Pardon my ignorance. I don't know exactly what that means, but I would assume it's very good. <laughs> well, Halo Reach, you actually level up your Spartan. Inheritor is the max. Level. It is crossplay, but only for multiplayer, forge, and firefight. Okay. So. What's up, dude? You ready to get bundle boxes? Yeah, I know. No, he, he came. He came in smiling. I knew it. He. Damn it! No. <laughs> I had the. Oh, Josh. He said he had the blue flaming skull helmet. Yeah, that's Imperator. Yeah, yeah. So. Take him to the shelter for warmth. This game's really fun. Slap some moss on that gash and wrap it well. <laughs> Oh, that's definitely broken. Remember the boars you fell our first day in England. Hold his arms. Nine. Large and fat. Fed us for a week. Yeah. Yeah. Rip it in. You'll be chasing more in a month, my friend. Get it, girl. You come like a Valkyrie out of the fog. We have no debt to give you. <clears throat> you must be Soma. Let's talk elsewhere. Give them a chance to rest. Quite a hit you took. How many were lost? It's kind of you to ask, but with so much blood in the water and death on the air, I'd know your name and purpose first. Eivor of the Raven Clan. I came for you, looking for a friend and ally. I see. I'm Soma, Lord of Grandbridge. Though it seems an order of lunatics wishes to strip me of that title. The Order of the Ancients? Sounds right. The Saxon called Wigmund is one of them. He robbed me of my city forced us into these swamps. I've rallied some of my soldiers, but my three advisors are missing. If we hope to retake Grand Bridge, I'll need them at my side. Tell me about them. They are my best, my inner circle. Bena, Galin, leave. We may as well be of the same blood. If I can reunite them and retake your city, can I call you a friend and ally? If you can do all that, you can call me whatever you want. What happened to Grandbridge? The elder man Wigman yeah, dude. from us. Well, when you get I'm your PC, sure we can play through them together. Like Not for long. He has supporters outside the city. But this attack seemed to come from inside the walls. From the heart of Grandbridge. And I'm totally down for that. Where's this Wigman? What does he want? He's a flailing elderman under the old king. A bitter man digging his fingernails into Grand Bridge, just to say he can. He's made many attempts to unseat me before. This time he managed a trick. Let's find you. Agreed. We'll look. The fog is more hindrance than hiding place now. Let's light the way back. I actually don't. This is actually the Valhalla theme. Oh. Oh, is that the, like, the new Assassin's Creed? Yep. It's so good. Yeah, it's I really good. like the it. The graphics look pretty good. Yeah, it's, it's really good. I'm glad the Assassin's Creed's are getting progressively better. Yes. 
I mean, their storyline has always been pretty good. Yeah, I wholeheartedly agree. Yeah, that's a definite, definite true, true statement. And yeah, let's just play through it. I'm probably going to play for one more half hour and uh, we can go get food. Yeah. That's the one thing about PC, though. PC just makes everything better. But also just the Assassin's Creed in general. Indeed. Absolutely. That's the truth. Oh, she's up there. Yep, oh, light the, the beacon. I <laughs> hear that. Climb anything in Assassin's Creed. Click key. Okay. Gotta love when your Burn internet just decides it doesn't Wolf want to be a brand. thing for ten seconds. I hear that, brother. Warriors home. <laughs> okay. Do -do -do -do. A rescue mission. So what is the storyline for this one so far? Uh, the storyline starts out, um, you're young, your village gets raided by, a, like, a crazy tyrant barbarian, barbarian leader, oh, who's a viking. He slaughters your village, kills your mom and dad, and then, um, it flashes forward to your full-grown adult Viking, and you have you, the, you, the first mission is your you avenging your uh, your parents, and then just taking the fight to him. You kill him, and then the story. I'm at the point where the story proceeds forward, and I'm trying to figure out everything now. I'm only on like chapter two, I think, but it's it's been good so far. Quarter of twelve. I should get some rest. Absolutely, brother. Thanks for stopping by, man. I appreciate you. Absolutely. I'll see you Tuesday, brother. Stay classy and thanks for stopping by. Looking forward to getting your PC done so we could start playing together. such a great game. Yeah, Odyssey was huge. My goodness. That's the truth. Odyssey was an absolute monstrosity. 16th, I should have it up and running, provided nothing is broken in shipment. Absolutely, dude. I cannot wait. We're going to have way too much fun. I am super stoked for you, man. I'm like, I, I kid you not, dude. I'm like genuinely excited to play Fault together. We're going to have way too much fun. Superhuman, like all Assassin's Creed characters, yeah. they can climb marble. Man, that's huge. Mm -hmm. Yeah, dude, it's nuts. Mm -hmm. 
this uh, this is a really nice refresh rate monitor, so it, it captures gaming really well. So like I can, there's like no, there's no delay. You know what I mean? There's no yeah. motion blur or anything like that. So it's the best way to play. Uh, it's actually a 144. So yeah. All right, where do we want to go? to get out of the way. That would be great. Open the door. Kindly. the goodies. Give me the loot. Give me the loot.
Come here. Oh, oh. How'd you guys get in there? Hey! Can't do this alone! You were like in there waiting. That it's foolish to search defenders for so few people. You told me the soldiers you lost were your best. Vital to retake in the city. Do you think it's foolish? Not at all. Then why would I? You have the look of one who does well with solitude. You're alone, a wanderer. It may be you think of soldiers as war fodder and little else. But these warriors are more than a blade and a shield. Hey, they are come here a moment! Nothing. I've lost a city this week. I will not lose them too. I understand. And if your people yet live, we'll find them. Okay, can someone help me? That'd be great. Come on. Give me a hand over here! Alright, it's cool. I don't want any treasure or anything. Give me a hand with this. Come on. I was just talking about how much I like this Come, game. Come, help me with this. And you guys can't follow simple instructions. This is so irritating. Moron, come here. Hey, come here. Am I speaking a foreign language? Good talk. There, a priest treasury.
continue later. Let us raid. What's up, boo? Beast. I don't deserve this. Leave me. Run. Boy. You want to have a socket with him? Come here, Leverhouse boy. <clears throat> you hanging out? You hanging out with Daddy's Leverhouse boy? What? <laughs> what? You hanging out? Are you the Leverhouse boy? I think you are. Feel stronger already. Feel stronger already. Enough shoes. That's from Diablo. <laughs> That's the Lava House boy. Not enough fury. Boy. That was dope. Not enough fury. <clears throat> What's up, dude? I got you. Get up. And you revive him just like that. <sighs> Hell yeah, dude. Tell him get back on This is Assassin's Creed. We do what we want. Damn it, Seth. Shut up. <laughs> That's the love of the What's up, boo? That's the only drawback I think I have with the game. Is yeah, that, that kind of it's kind of buggy. Crappy. It's kind of buggy at times. I mean, I don't blame it since it's like a pretty big game. Yeah, there's, there's a whole heck of a lot of rendering. That is for sure. What are you doing, that bad boy? You're being such a good boy. Such a good boy, that bad boy. What? Alright, now we're gonna assassinate this guy? It's gonna be great. Alright, definitely dodge that, but that's cool. That's how the Lord works. Definitely dodge that too. That's cool.
you. Free the prisoner. Gods be good to you, and thank you. Oh, the gods be good to you. There are some elements that I'm glad that some games simplify stuff like that. Because otherwise it would take forever. You just call me when you want me to take the train still, okay? He's being good right now, so I don't mind him being here. Yeah. <laughs> I should have got those other treasures. What are you doing, that bad boy? What are you doing? Joshua. Behave now. Son, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Adore. Adore. Wabble, wabble. Wabble blah, la ass boy, wabble blah. <laughs> look, look, la ass boy. <gasps> look! That's the la ass boy. Is that the la ass boy? Is that the la ass boy, Dad? <laughs> Why are you taking Daddy's headphones? You can't do that. You can't do that, la ass boy. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing here? Huh? Uncle Josh! He wants to jungle Jim Daddy. Oh! Come here. Go to mommy for a sec. Daddy's almost done. And then we're gonna do lunch. Man, my wrist is so effed. How the hell did I get in here? I was about to say. If I can't get out. Honey, do we do you did you put sodas in the fridge? Okay, I was just curious. Let's use the dark 
reasoning here, too. There it is. Come buddy. Be 
wretch. very much like to get in there. Maybe. Honey. Uh, I'm gonna get food for everybody for lunch. Do you want to get it when you go to the store, or? Yeah, I would just do that. Um, not that I, not, not, not gonna, oh, I can sorry, think I'm of right sorry. now. Yeah. Do you to a what? A what? Yes, please. Okay. Absolutely. And, uh, could you get, um, an Oreo McFlurry, too? Are you gonna share? Yes. I'm going to throw up so many times. <laughs> My love, our boy. He can't help himself. Where you going, bud? That's all right. Daddy's almost done, and then he'll hang out with you. Daddy just had to stream because he can't do it tonight. God, my wrist is so shot.
Oi, let's go, laddies. Saxons surrounding that old hut. And maybe Danes trapped inside. Sweeping the hearth outside? We have lit just fine. Thinking of starting a new tower. This house being our first. Follow on, Lillian. Leaf and Galen are safe at the camp we've made. Abel, you meet us there when you're ready. Be safe. Love you too. <laughs> Love you too. Beacon has drawn the last of my soldiers. By tomorrow, our strength will have returned, and we can retake our city. I have not yet spoken to Leif, Birna, and Galen about this. After my missteps, I worry what they must think of me.
They'll be grateful you risk your life to find them. I would be. By Thor's hammer, I am glad we're together. In spite of our setback. Galen, you look... well worn. Do not grieve the men you lost. They will be singing your praises in the corpse hall, waiting for us. Thank you, Jarl's corner. Leif, you'd outlast any tempest. It's good to be back, Sona, all as one. And know this, that I will follow you through the eye of the storm if you call it. Fear now. I'm delighted you're alive. I'm delighted to be living. I lost so many after all this, but I still have you three. That makes me the most blessed warrior in Midgard. And Eivor, you have more than proven your worth. Help us reclaim our city, and you will have an ally in me. My blade is yours, for Grandbridge. We'll rest for the night, gather our strength and our wits, and at the break of dawn's light, we retake Grandbridge! Pass the night in our camp, Eivor. Take anything you need. Looks like more of Soma's forces followed the beacon back to camp. Garland, is that right? That's right. You are Eivor, the infinite fighter, the forever warrior. It's a glorious name. Many thanks. You were in a tight spot when we found you. Indeed. The Saxons pursued me, ran me bloody through the swamps and into the lap of bandits. And the wolves came. We all have our one day, the day we die. How you greet that day is all that matters. I'm proud to say that I was ready. Well, it's good to see you breathing still. Leif, Soma says you're the man who built her longships. That's right. Each has a sharp keel, a stout mast, and a poem etched into the hull to sing the praises of the Dringer who commands her. A longship is heavy with fate. Just a few links of wood between you and a watery grave. What better place to put a line of poetry, hmm? Agreed. It's good to fight beside you, Leif. Likewise, Ava. Thanks again for plucking me and my warriors from the mire. You're Vienna. And you are Eivor's sunbeam. You cut through the fog like the sun burns through ice. You're in high spirits, all things considered. The ambush, losing your home. In this moment, yes. But ah, you feel that? The moment has passed. We are free to pursue the next. What a gift! It's good to have you in this fight, Vienna. I like you, Eivor. You may help me here or step on me. And by the look of you, I'd welcome either.
day is new and the air is bracing. Are you ready for the fight ahead? Let's take your city back. That's what I like to hear. Meet me at the western gate of Grand Bridge. We've assembled there. Have care you do not enjoy taking orders from anyone but your Jarl back home. I fight for Sigurd, none else. While you're on this ship, Dag, you fight for me. And for Soma's loyalty. We fight for her. They're off. Screw it. Let's just go fight. Ball sail. Strike up a two. Hidden. One on each side of the door. Move when you get. Bridge to me, Wigmund. No more of our people need die. We may talk this out, lord to lord. <laughs> what are we to talk about? You have nothing I need. Worth by birth, even. I was born a noble. You were plucked from a giant's armpit. I built this town from a mud hut to a thriving port. And we both know you'll bleed those ridges dry without my guiding hand. Leave. Go die in the muck where you belong, heathens! Wigman! Wigman! Let's try one final time! Quit Grantbridge! And when she is mine once more, I may spare your life! Ha! I command Grantbridge! I am master here! And I will scour you rats from this land like rot from a festering wound! Let me give you some advice, old bear! The surest way to stop a wound from festering isn't with a blade. It's with fire. It's with fire. <laughs> no! Thanes of Grandebridgeshire! Retake what is yours! <laughs> what has Whitman done to her? No time for it. We must clear our course.
Let's end this. <laughs> Let your plague-ridden body feed my fields. Eivor, to me. No sign of Wickman here. He may be hiding within the city walls. <clears throat> Shall we search? No. He'll be gone. Count on it. Argar coward. But we've struck a bold claim today. Walk with me. I want you to sound our battle horn to announce our victory. Bridge is retaken. The sound of the horn means prosperity, long life, bounty. Why me? Why not? You were the keystone to this attack. You turned the tide. Let the wind from your lungs breathe life back into my city.
tonight. Tonight we feast as gods. Hey, Everyone's shit faced. <clears throat> My clan throws the best feasts, I think you'll find. You enjoy yourself? I did. But were you celebrating or mourning? You looked unsure. The night of the attack, I heard sounds of bloodshed coming from the Longhouse. In moments, the city was overrun with Saxons, so I called a retreat. We all have our one day, but not like that. Not that day. I've heard this before. That the Saxons appeared as if from the shadows. In all my time in Grantbridge, this tunnel was my most careful project. The best kept secret in the city. Now a hundred or more Saxons know the smell of it. The only people who knew about this tunnel were me, and the three in my inner circle. You believe you were betrayed? I know I was. By whom? That is where I hesitate. Between Leif, Galen, and Birna, I cannot say. But they are the three who helped me dig this in secret. I hoped you might lend me your wits. You are a fresh ally. I could use your eyes and ears. I promised you I'd help secure your city. That task isn't yet done, it seems. Good. I sent Galen, Leif, and Birna to destroy what remains of Wigman's power throughout the Shire. Meet with them. Raid with them. Get to know them as best as you can. Find out which of them betrayed me. I'll do what I can, but you know your warriors far better than I do. Between you and me, my heart is clouded. I love these three as if we shared a womb. I need clear, sound judgment. I need you, Eivor. You have me. Thank you. Feel free to take a look around as you wish. Search the city, the tunnel, and here, a gift, for retaking Grand Bridge with us. One of the few things I have left from my blood family. To understand your people well, I should better know you. How did you rise to the rank of Yalskona? My king Guthrum led the summer army through this land. When he marched into Wessex, I volunteered to defend the city. To encourage trade, so that our forces would be rich and strong if called upon. Guthrum agreed. So I grew the city up from very little, and I fell in love with her. It was a dagger to the heart to lose it, and a balm to have it back. If I can find your traitor, what will you do with them? They will die by my hand. No pain. No public humiliation. A traitor or no, the bastard is also one of my closest people. My friend. My family. Only I will bear the burden of causing their death. It will not muddy the minds of any other. That is enough. Why do you love Grandbridge so deeply? I was orphaned young. ...but old enough to remember it. I feel I've been reaching for a family all my life. Grantbridge is more than some silver boon. She's a place for me to build that family. For anyone who needs one. Wanderers, smugglers, and craftsmen alike. That's all. 
Good luck, Eivor. Thank you for doing this. The markets are up and running again. Soma doesn't waste time. Did you see anything strange on the night of the attack? Mm. Come to think of it, I noticed one of the longships wasn't where it usually is. It was beached further north, on the riverbank. Where was this? Northeast of here, along the shore. It's been a few days, though. May not be there now. I have not had the win all day. Ah, Orlok. Yes, Orlok. Join me? Let us play. Straight into the point. May the best hand win. This will do. This will do. Should have grabbed one of the headgears. Let's just try again. My game, stranger. Just give up. Are you even trying? This cannot be. I challenge you to another round. 
That is enough all out for now. It's faster than me, and you are the victor. Let's see your silver. What's a drinking game without a prize? The horde it is. Man your horn. Let's do it. Yes. Hey, you are piss ass drunk. Shall we lock horns? Sink it faster than me. You are the winner. Is it the silk? Think you can swill with the best? Ah, a thirsty foe. Down it faster than me, and you are the victor. We drink. Come on, I need a challenger. Let's get alcohol poisoning. <laughs> <laughs> 